What's up guys, He King here bringing you a live reaction to The Last of Us 2 trailer. So yeah, um, I was really hoping they would reveal this, you know, at this event and it looks like they have. So I can't wait to see it. Sorry, just fixing the focus there because it's a bit, eh, I don't know, I feel like it's a bit unfocused. Uh, is it a bit unfocused? No, there we go. Hope it's better. Anyway, let's watch it. And I'll give you my thoughts on it. <laughs> here we... Wait, yeah. And here we... Go. May contain content inappropriate, yeah, definitely. Graphics look nice, as always. No, this is a cutscene, not in-game footage. Really? Claw marks. I hear footsteps. Firefly symbol on there. So I guess they're back. You wouldn't have that in there otherwise, if they weren't back. I think that's any breathing. It is, is it? Oh. Trembling hands. Oh no, it's Joel. It's Joel, isn't it? Yeah. What's going on? Or is it Ellie? I don't know. Hands look a bit feminine, but the the chest must like must look the guy, right? Oh, it is Eddie. No evil. So this is an actual song. Good. My gun, it come from me. Cause I know I should be bitten again. Kill my enemies when they come. Just crying blood. Who was dead? Holy goodness and mercy will follow me all the days of my life. And I will dwell on this earth forever more said I walked it's Joel, isn't it? yeah. the still waters and they restore my soul but I can't walk on the path of the right because I'm wrong yeah Joel. I can't walk on the path did she kill those guys or someone said that they're friends? It looks like they live here, so No, it looks like she killed them. What are you doing, kiddo? Troy Baker man. You really gonna go through with this? So this is Ellie when she's 19 years old now, yeah? She was 14 last time, wasn't she? I'm gonna find... And I'm gonna kill... Every last one of them. The last of us. Godfather 2 style. <laughs> Naughty dog. Greatness awaits. Is that it? In development. Well, it's already been in development for a while, hasn't it? So, yeah. We already knew it was being made. It's just we were waiting for the announcement. It's been a year or two now, I think. Because didn't, didn't, um... What's his name? What's his name? 
What's the guy's name that plays Nathan Drake? I can't believe I forgot his name. Not Nolan North, he revealed that they were making the sequel to this, so... Yeah. So yeah, uh, that was The Last of Us Part 2, as it's called. Um, I'm going to be honest with you guys, I was not a big fan of The Last of Us Part 1. Uh, I thought it was an overrated bloody game. My problem with the game was, was that the story was too predictable. I predicted the entire bloody thing. Like I, w I even predicted the ending. So for me, it was just one of those games that just didn't do it for me. It was too much. The game held your hand too much. It was too scripted. It was basically a movie at times. Like, and I know it comes across as a complaint. You have to get. You have to understand me. I love my story-focused games, but that game, I don't know. I felt like it had the potential to be more than it could have been, and it was too, too, too much of that, especially sort of like the enemy variety and that and the story and the I didn't really feel connected to any of the characters like I, like every time we were introduced to a character they would either, either die or leave us like so in the end I just didn't give a crap I, Marlene was hardly developed for me to give enough of a shit um, T Tessa just she, she came and she went Bill was great and then he just went and then we got introduced to, the, to those uh, to the black guys who were obviously gonna die at, uh, and then they did so it's like well no Danny and Sam, was it? Yeah. A waste. Um, Nolan, Nor Nolan North as David was actually really good. Like, that was surprising. He played a very good villain, a very screwed up villain. So, those sections of the game were really done well. But, I don't know, I feel like... And this is my complaint with every Naughty Dog game, including Uncharted. I feel like the first half of all their games is always the best part. And the second half is always the worst. Because it just feels like it starts dragging. Like they can never get the balance right. In terms of giving us something different and new. Like like Last of Us. It, it, the first half was great. Or up to the point where I think you leave the city. You go for the sewers and then Danny and Sam. No, I think all up to that was great. And then once you get to the dam. It just it just dragged. It just felt like it dragged too much. And then, of course, you've got the Enchanted games, like Enchanted 2, first half is great, the next half just drags until you get to, like, to, to Shambhala. Enchanted 3, the story's great in the first half, but then the second half is great in terms of the action, so, like, it doesn't really even itself out, and then Enchanted 4, great first half, and then the next half on the island, I don't know, like, that's my problem with Naughty Dog, I feel like they don't know how to balance the game, it's just the same thing every single time, like, so, to be honest... I'm not that hyped for this. I'm gonna get it obviously when it comes out. Oh, I, I probably won't. I probably wait for a Game of the Year edition like they did with the first one. Like, well, they'll probably release DLC in that. Um, so I'm not that bothered. I'm not that hyped for it. I'm, I'm, I'm look. I'm, I'm, I'm curious about the possibilities. The whole, the whole angle. Because I already read up on this that this game is meant to be more about uh, the theme of hate instead of the theme of love in the first game. So I'm curious how that's gonna work. Like, what the concept of it is. What they're gonna do next with it, how they're going to grow these characters, how they're going to define them, so, but, at the same time, I'm just not that excited, it looks good, don't get me wrong, but we haven't, you know, they, they promised us a lot of things in the first game, and it didn't really end up the way they said it would, so, I'm not that excited, excited, unfortunately, which is probably a good thing, because it means that, then again, the sad thing is that, before getting The Last of Us, before I played it, I even had all these reservations about how the plot was going to be and what the actual gameplay was going to be like. And when I did play it, I just felt, I felt like I was correct on all grounds. So in the end, the game still disappointed me, even though my expectations were low to begin with, with the first game. So it's kind of the same thing here. Like, I'm just, I'm expecting a game that's going to look good. It's going to have its moments, but overall, it's just going to be another overrated game where people are going to be like oh the story's great and it's like no no it's cliche and we've seen it a dozen times before and we've seen games that have done it better as well so that's just my opinion on it though um don't get you know i like naughty dog i like their games but they're not that great like they could be better take that from what you will take what you will from that <laughs> as always guys uh, if you like my reaction uh, like and subscribe or whatever and i shall see you and i shall see you take care